What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. So today's video is a Costco haul. I just got back. I'm going to show you guys everything I got. I got some food and then I got some non-food stuff because they're having really, really good sales there. And I think I did really good. So if you guys are new, would love for you guys to subscribe. I do lots, lots of cleaning motivation videos, Costco hauls, cooking videos, and stuff like that. So would love for you guys to stick around and subscribe during the Family Hero Style Mom XO. But we're gonna get right into this Costco haul. I am gonna go ahead and try and put the price on every single item as it comes up on the screen. So then you guys know um, exactly how much it was and if it was on sale. I can tell you that I did spend a total of $271.40. So $9.84 of that was tax, but yes, 271 was my grand total. So let's go ahead and get right on to the haul. Okay, you guys, so this is a overview of it all. Again, $271. Let's go ahead and start off on this end. So I ended up getting some of this Kirkland Lean Ground Beef, and these are five individual packs, one pound each. So I figured this might actually be easier than buying the pack and dividing it up myself. Um, they are just these, there we go. There are these rounds, and I can just stick this straight inside the freezer in the garage, and I just can pull it out when I need one pack, and I don't have to waste my Ziploc baggies or anything like that. This is something new that we haven't tried. This is the Tyson Black Pepper Herb Chicken Breast Strips. So they're not breaded or anything like that. This is low carb. Um, I figured that this would be perfect for my husband, um, especially when we're trying to go ahead and watch what we're eating. Um, I did get some lettuce that I'll show you guys, so this would be really easy to warm up, put on salad, or or just do some veggies on the side and have this on the side. So this actually looked really good and I figured it was already cooked, ready to go, so. Of course, you guys know I always get this. This is the Tyson Boneless Skinless Chicken. Um, this is a 10 pound bag. I usually buy two. I think today's the 13th of the month, so I figured I can go ahead and get away with buying one along with the ground beef and this and other stuff that I already have inside the outdoor freezer right now. Um, but this is just such a good price for chicken breast. It's already skinned and everything. So this is something that we always, always get. This is another thing that has quickly turned into a staple in our house, the Kirkland cheese pizzas. It comes in a pack of four, very affordable, really good, especially just for like Friday nights or Saturday lunches. You can just pop this right in the oven and it feeds the family with a side salad and anything like that. Picked up some avocados. These are not ripe, ready to go, but it is okay. We're gonna put them in a dark place and have them ripen up maybe for this weekend. Today, when I'm filming this, this is Wednesday. You guys will actually be seeing this tomorrow. So happy Thursday to you guys. Um, but we love, love, love our avocados. So I went ahead and picked up that. We were getting a low on our oil. So I decided just to go ahead and pick up a pack. Um, it actually broke as I was putting it in the car. Thank goodness it didn't bust open or fall on my toes, but I just got the vegetable oil. That's kind of what I always normally get. So it comes in a two pack if you guys are unfamiliar with that. Um, this I went ahead and got. So this is a Sensible Eco Living and it comes with two trash cans. They are miniature size which is perfect for i don't want to say miniature size they're small um but this is perfect for a laundry room bathroom this was actually on sale for 15.99 for both of them there's two in here it has like a little step that you um can go ahead and push and the top comes up so i am really excited and then the inside of it actually comes out so then you can actually clean the inside and all that type of stuff so the reason why I went ahead and purchased this was because I wanted to put one at the bar just so it looked nice and clean. We have one in there right now, but I'm not really happy the way it looks. And then I'm gonna put one in the laundry room just because it has a lid and it just will look a lot nicer. So that's my game plan for that. Of course, the Quaker Chewy um, bars and these are in chocolate chip and peanut butter. The kids love those. 
this is the salad that I was talking about. This is a spring mix. Um, it is a really big container, but we love the salad. Just put salad dressing, chicken on top, and it is good for lunches or snacks or anything like that. We needed some more garlic salt and I've been slowly like building up my collection over at Costco just because they're so big um, that it just, I don't have, I don't find myself constantly always buying them. So we needed some more garlic salt. So I picked that up. These chips I got last time I did a haul and they were so good. This is the Himalayan salt potato chips and this is Kirkland Kettle um, brand and they are just so good. They're so simple but just so tasty if you want to go ahead and just snack on them like that. My husband does make homemade salsa. Uh, we do avocado dip. I do plan on doing for Cinco de Mayo. I am going to go ahead and do a video. Sorry, the lighting is like real weird right now. Um, on my husband's margarita because they are just the best the way he does them. And then I was going to have us film a video kind of like all themed like that. So margaritas, um, avocado dip, two different ways that we do it, and then the homemade salsa. So definitely go ahead and keep your eyes out for that around Cinco de Mayo because we're gonna go ahead and put that video together. So this was actually a sample when we were walking around. I had Nevea with me today. She wasn't feeling good last night. Um, and these are the coconut clusters. So they have cashews, pumpkin seeds, sunflower seeds, um, quinoa and chai seeds so they are just like she was snacking on a couple of them in the car and they are just like little clusters that you can go ahead and eat um i didn't eat any because i'm actually allergic to cashews and she can actually eat this she's allergic to almonds but these don't have almonds so that's really good. She love, love, love those. You guys know this is my favorite butter of all time, Kerrygold butter. They sell it at Costco, so I try and pick it up there once a month, and you can actually freeze this if you guys didn't know. Um, picked up these Yazo mint chocolate chip um, yogurt ice creams. My son loves these, and his favorite are either mint chocolate chip or like the salted caramel flavors. Anything mint chocolate chip, anything salted caramel, he is game for. Then I picked up some of the muffins. If you guys don't know, it is, how much is it? $7.99, I think it is, for two of them. So we got um, blueberry muffins and chocolate. Next up, these Tortilla Land. Um, these are fresh tortillas that you actually cook yourself. They're uncooked. Literally takes like 30 seconds on each side. These are the best tortillas, really like similar to homemade ones. Um, definitely, definitely need to try this out. Of course, God Smackers and Crustables. I cannot live without those. And then the kids like these Izzy's. It's kind of like a treat for them when they get them at school every once in a while. They'll be selling them. Um, well, at Danny's school. And then Nevaeh's school doesn't sell these, but he's brought one home for her in the past. And they really like them. This was actually on sale. So I decided to go ahead and just surprise the kids and pick up a case. Of course, this won't be like an everyday thing, but we don't drink soda in the house. So this is a sparkling juice is like a better alternative. So that's why I picked that up. We needed more toilet paper. We just get the Kirkland brand. Um, it's just easy that it comes in a big pack and affordable. I wanted to pick up some more downy. I'm not running out of it yet, but I know maybe in about a week, week and a half, I will be out of it. So I just wanted to pick it up since I was already there. And then I got some Puma shoes. So this is an Earlberry. Um, so it's like a pink purple and it is just so pretty like Puma shoes. These were actually on sale for $24.99 They come in this Earlberry and as well as gray I might actually go back and get the gray as well Just because they were such a good affordable price when you guys see this video They will still be on sale. So definitely head over there if you guys want to get yourself a really good brand shoe for $24.99 so I picked those up and then they actually had Puma workout pants for I think $15.99. So I got a black pair and what I like about these is the black has the gold Puma but then it has like this kind of, I don't even know what this is called, like layered knee look and then on the other side it's kind of like a clear like mesh um, on that side. So. 
really cool they had them in black and gray and then in this blue which this blue i'm just obsessed with and it has the same thing except it is a silver puma and then it just has the um layered kind of look right here along with the mesh so i got them in the black as well as this like really pretty blue i don't know if this is like cornflower blue or what but love it so that is it you guys i'm gonna hurry up and get this inside the freezer and get some dinner started my husband is not feeling good this whole week has just been a hot mess with everybody not feeling good we've been up and down the whole time change situation so he might be coming home a little bit early today because he just isn't feeling great so i'm gonna go ahead and get a turkey tenderloin in the oven right now just so when he gets home he has something to eat something real mild so i'm gonna go ahead and do that get this stuff put away don't forget to subscribe if you guys are new and also leave down in the comment box what is your guys's go-to like at Costco? Because I love trying new things. I love seeing what you guys like absolutely get every single time you go other than the churro. Of course, I already ate the churro in the car. <laughs> that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye you guys. Mm -hmm.